The full launch of MLB The Show 22 is finally here, and we got an emergency market Monday late night upload coming your way. We have some investment and stuff making opportunities that have presented themselves today. So I want to get this video out for you all so you can take advantage of it. I know how dry the market has been this year for flipping. It's slowly getting a little bit better. I'm seeing that improve ever so slightly tonight. We can see that with our shows on reports as well. We haven't had any major, major investment opportunities. Chances to make a lot of stubs. We have that presented to us today. I want to make sure y'all are able to take advantage of that and capitalize on it before it's too late. So we got this late night video coming up. We got quite a few things here to break down in this one. First off out the gate, if you are on Xbox, you're playing on Game Pass or you have whatever version and you have Game Pass, you can get free packs here and it will be the show 22. Just want to press your home button down here you'll press on game pass you'll then filter over here into perks yours will most likely pop up right up here at the top i've already come through and redeemed it i've redeemed my launch bundle 10 free pack bundle here if you're on game pass be sure to come in and redeem that that's 10 free packs you do nothing for it you never know what you're gonna pull out of those take all the free packs you can get come in and redeem those bad boys really simple takes two seconds it'll automatically show up in your account as well before we get into our investments i do want to put out real quick we do have a brand new program drop today we have the nike city connect uniforms you can obtain all seven of these uniforms and when you do so you are going to get 15,000 xp in your face of the franchise program as well there's a new collection for these so come in do your moments and do your player xp missions those are the only ones you have to do you don't have to do any of the exchanges if you don't want to both of those right there that'll get you to that hundred and get you 15,000 xp for the program we'll take all the program progress we can get as quickly as possible now continuing on with the program progress as well we have a brand new conquest map here dropping today i've already completed we have faces of the franchise west that is going to earn you 30,000 XP into the face of the franchise program. But in terms of stub making opportunities, we are going to be able to get two free prospect packs here prospect choice pack, National League West, and prospect choice pack, American League West. Obviously, we're going to get some XP and subs to go along with those as well. But two free prospect choice packs given out to everybody who does this conquest map. A lot of people are going to be grinding out this conquest map to get that xp as well if you've played past mob the shows you know packs in conquest maps can create some of the best investment opportunities in the entire game let's quickly look through and see what the market is looking like on these nl and american league west prospects these gold prospects and what their market could look like moving forward and what kind of change we could possibly expect on these cards now that they've been dropped and we have this massive influx into the market. So we're here. I have the market filter now by prospect cards. We can see a lot of these 4,500 subs, 5,000 subs for a couple of these. Then we get to Ryan Nelson, the D-backs prospect. And he's 1,800. Luis Matos, he's 1,800 subs. And we're back up to 47, 42, 5,300. Emerson Hancock, 1,591. Harris, 1633. James Wood for 1700 subs. What is causing these changes in such drastic differences in prospect packs? You get the same amount of them through the USA Conquest. Of course, this is from the AL and NL West prospect choice packs in that Conquest map that is driving down the prices of these West prospect cards. Everybody's getting them coming in and selling them. So, cards that were selling for 4,000, 4,500 subs or even more the other day are now selling for 1,800, 1,900. 1600 subs 1700 subs 1600 subs again we can go on to another page 1800 subs 1500 1500 1600 again lots of investment opportunities here if we're able to come in and pick up these cards for 1600 subs even if we don't hold them for a super long term period of time i'm able to buy them for 1600 now and then come uh wednesday afternoon maybe even early thursday thursday afternoon all of a sudden the prices is increasing on these maybe they don't get back to 5,000 subs maybe they don't get back to 4,500 subs even if they get back to 4,000 subs or 3,000 subs if i'm buying them at 1600 they get back to 3,000 subs i'm making over a thousand subs profit per each card that is really really good margins here early on in this game flipping has been rough this is one of our best early opportunities if you've been playing it with the show before, you know that when prices crash down due to an influx of packs, there always is a rebound after that. It may not be 
to the level where it's at now but there will be a redown not to mention if you're trying to get that adley rushman prospect card just became a ton more affordable with these 10 cars from the al and nl west personally for me i'm investing in some of these at 15 16 17 even 1800 stubs 1900 i can turn around and sell those in a couple of days for 3500 to 4000 stubs i am making a really great profit margin on that and that's going to give me enough subs to make significant progress towards my collection goals here in this game flipping's been rough we've been waiting around for our first investment opportunity we have that here with these gold prospect cards definitely recommend picking up on these and as well with the quick sell changes this year 83 overall is going to quick sell for 1200 subs so even less risk than we would have before they're not going to get down the quick sell value there's really no risk in that i believe all of these have already hit the floor and are starting the rebound especially as more people become aware of the drop in their price we're going to see more and more people coming in to pick these up off of the rebound so definitely expect these to go up quite a good chunk here see a really really strong rebound happening for these prospect cards that have been holding a really solid value also want to make a quick note 90 plus live series diamonds have come down quite a bit today this may be the last drop of them we have for quite some time guys like mike trout 330k uh the down to 120 acuna under 200 000 stubs Shures are now on the sell now under 50k we see a lot of drops here with our 90 plus diamonds if you're looking to pick complete collections a good day to come in and pick them up all the influx of packs coming in with all the game pass packs today people are going to be ripping those cards and when they get those 90 pluses they're selling those and all those new players are not having the stubs to necessarily go out and obtain more 90 plus overall cards while we're having an influx of those into the market so those prices are going down and we can see some prices rising elsewhere with some of these mid diamonds into our mid mid to high golds as well as people are selling their 90 pluses and kind of turning those into those to get a more fleshed out well-rounded squad overall though great day to pick up 90 plus cards if you're needing those for collections probably gonna be the lowest we're gonna see for some time and so we start seeing some 90 plus live series diamond packs as we get into the summer months most likely not gonna see it before then so i expect the trend line to continue up from this point so short and sweet today first real investment opportunity of the year was the day go out get you some of those west prospect cards they should rebound really nicely of course we can never predict the market with complete 100 accuracy but we have quite a big sample and track record of being able to know that packs from the conquest drive market down a rebound quickly afterwards within the next couple days so expect those to be a good little rebound in worst case they're actually a pretty solid flip right now as well moving really quick in the market as well go get some of those if you're looking to do collections pick up some 90 plus cards and of course if you're on game pass don't forget to redeem your free packs as always if you enjoyed the video definitely be sure to leave a like and subscribe until next time i'll catch y'all around